Hey guys, this is Subhash Mishra. Today we will learn another Python program. We will see how to write a Python program to find minimum of three numbers. So, in our last program, we have seen how to find maximum of three numbers. In this program, we will see how to find minimum of three numbers. Okay. So, for that, we will take three variables. Okay. Number one, for example, number one is equal to 10 and number two is equal to 20 and number three is equal to 30. Okay. So, if we, we have these three numbers, we will try to find which one is the minimum one. Okay. So, here I have taken three variables number 1, number 2, number 3 all are integers and I have assigned the value as 10, 20 and 30. Okay. So, we will write program okay, how to find the smallest one. So, the very first one we will write a if condition. Okay. It is again the same way how we have found how we have written a program to find maximum of three numbers okay in the similar fashion we will write this program so first you will write if condition if okay number 1 is less than or equal to okay number 2 and number 1 is less than equal to number 3 okay then what you are telling if number 1 is less than equal to number 2 and number 1 is less than equal to number 3, then you print number 1 is the smallest one. Okay. We will print the number also. Okay. Fine. Then we will write else if number 2 is less than equal to number 1 okay and number 2 is less than equal to number 3 okay here we'll say number 2 is the smallest one okay else number 3 is the smallest one where is the program i will explain you everything don't worry okay let me run so you know here the result should be number 1 okay number 1 is the smallest one okay so let's see how we got this result right how we got number 1 as the smallest one so here we have taken three variables we have assigned the value as 10 20 and 30 number 1 equal to 10 number 2 equal to 20 and number 3 equal to 30 if number 1, what is the number 1 value? 10. 10 is less than equal to number 2. 10 is less than equal to number 2 means 10 is less than equal to 20. Yes, this is correct and number 1, 10 is less than equal to number 3. Number 3 value is 30. 10 is less than equal to 30. Yes, that is also correct. So, if these two conditions are matching, then we should print this. Number 1 is the smallest one. That is what we printed here. Okay. So, anyway these two conditions is not matching right. Now, what we will do? I will just put this as 5, okay, only 5. Let me execute. See number 2 is the smallest one that is 5. Okay, so, let us see how it executed. Number 1, number 1 value is equal to 10. 10 is less than equal to 5, num number 2, no. 10 is less than equal to 30, yes. But anyway, this condition is not matching. So, it will not execute this statement. Okay. It will come here else if number 2, number 2 is 5, 5 is less than equal to number 1 means 10. Yes, this is correct and number 2 which is 5 is less than equal to number 3 which is 30, 5 is less than equal to 30. Yes, that is correct. It means as these two conditions are satisfied, then this statement will execute number 2 is the smallest one. So, that is why we are seeing number 2 is the smallest one. So, this LC flock executed anyway it will not come here right. So, we got the result as number 2. Now, let me do this thing 10, 5, 3 number 3 value is 3 now. So, we should get result as 3 let me execute. Okay. We are getting number 3 is the smallest one. Okay. So, what is happening here if number 1 is get less than equal to number 2 10 is less than equal to 5 no. 
10 is less than equal to 3 no so both the conditions are not matching anyway it will not execute this one it will not go inside it will come here number 2 5 is less than equal to 10 no number 2 is less than equal to 3 5 is less than equal to 3 no so these two conditions are also not matching so it will not come here so when these two blocks are not getting executed it means this one will get executed so number 3 is the smallest one so 3 we are getting as the smallest one so this is how you can find which one is the smallest one so here if you don't want to put directly if you don't want to put the value you can give the user input so you can write int input you can write enter number 1 okay similarly you can write here also you can write here also number 1 2 3 okay let me execute and show you so enter number 1 for example 20 number 2 120 number 3 5 see number 3 is the smallest one if i'll execute one more time number 1 34 number 2 25 number 3 87 see number 2 is the smallest one so this is how you can find or how you can write a python program to find minimum of three numbers i hope this video is helpful for you if you like this video please press the like button and share it with your friends if you have not yet subscribed to my channel please do subscribe also do watch all other python programs i have created a separate python programming series okay there are a lot of programs added to that playlist okay please go and watch all the programs thank you bye bye